Imagine this, you are on your way to work and it's a beautiful day. You walk in as usual, but you have forgotten something, something very important. It was your turn to take your child to daycare. Within minutes, your car turns into a hot oven and your child is left to suffer. It is every parent's worst nightmare, yet it happens on average 39 times per year. It is 100% avoidable. Pediatric heat stroke. This problem is growing rapidly throughout the United States. According to data from the National Security Council, 848 children have died from pediatric heat stroke in the last 20 years. Last year alone, a record high of 59 children in the United States died from being left in a hot car. As this graphic shows, even on seemingly cool days, temperatures within a closed car can skyrocket to over 100 degrees Fahrenheit in just one hour which can be fatal for children because they cannot regulate their body temperature as well as adults. They overheat faster. This problem was inspired by one of our faculty members who had a friend that went through this traumatic event. Our team decided that this was the problem we wanted to solve, and we started brainstorming a solution. Through various tests and research, we decided that we would use a button that would be placed behind the baby's back in a car seat. The button would communicate to the user's phone through an Arduino with GSM capabilities and a Bluetooth module, so that if the button is still pressed down when the phone is 20 feet away, a text will be sent to the user's phone through a SIM card, alerting them that their child is still in the car. We reached out to our local fire station and got in contact with Jeffrey Moore, the union president of the Butler County Fire Department. He responded to a similar issue a couple of years ago, and he was very excited about our project, saying, People are more distracted now than ever. Being distracted causes them to forget who is in their back seat. You need something to remind or refocus a person so a child does not get left behind or hurt. And this product does just that. This product greatly decreases the chances that an infant or child can get hurt. It's impressive to see a group of young adults recognize a need and put this kind of effort toward child safety. We all look forward to the finished product. So let's rewind back to the beginning and see how things would have changed with the use of our product. Before you even got inside your work building, our product would have alerted you of the weight still left in your car. You would have realized your mistake and ran back to save your baby from the increasing temperatures in the hot car before any lasting damage was done to your child. Our community is excited about our project and the impact that it will have. Our local mayor even asked us to speak about it at the next city council meeting. We hope that by creating this device, we will be able to educate parents and caregivers about the dangers of child pediatric heat stroke and prevent more children from dying from this issue. Our driving purpose is to create a safer community for parents, children, and animals.